Welcome back to what's new in just 17 days. Cleveland is on the clock. Betsy, that's when the NFL draft begins right here. It's something exciting, something to look forward to. And once again, here we are. The national spotlight is on us and it's inspired a new campaign to bring more people here for good. That's right. We want to keep them here. Marissa Sines explains. The rush of the yards on the football field and the rush in our big city, Cleveland, have one thing in common this year, the NFL draft. And while teams will be drafting players, the city is working to draft people. We really want people to consider living and working in Cleveland, um, not just visiting. Engage Cleveland, Destination Cleveland, and Team Neo have all teamed up and launched a new campaign. It's called the Cleveland Wants to Draft You campaign. This particular campaign is really more about how do we get people who are already familiar with Cleveland to re-engage, learn more about it, and, and really be more open to it. While the city hopes anyone will make their way for good, it's actually targeting people who aren't strangers to the city. We're targeting former residents. We're targeting former students. You know, Cleveland has gone through its ups and downs. One of the struggles, keeping people here. A study by LinkedIn showed that since the pandemic began, Cleveland saw a 6% growth in people who were marking it as their new home, but also shows that people are still leaving Cleveland, but at a much smaller rate. Clevelanders who have both been here their whole lives. I've been here all my life. Or moved away and came back. And I moved uh, back to Cleveland about two years ago. Agree with the core idea of this campaign that Cleveland is a great place to be. Cleveland is really developing and it has a lot to offer. Come back, we have uh, plenty of room for everybody. So signs, thank you very much. So to help bring more residents back home, those organizations that we talked about in the piece, will be using social media to target and deliver the message that Cleveland is a great place to live, a great place to work, and of course, a great place to play as well. The campaign will continue after the NFL draft into the first week of May. And you can count me in that group of people, Bets, who hails from this part of the country, moved away, and decided to come back. And I'm so thrilled that I did. You as well. Yeah. One of the things that you learn when you're from Cleveland and you go someplace else, I guess it's like that wherever home is and you leave, you just focus on all the positive things, all of the things you loved about that area in the mm -hmm. first place. And there's so many things to love about Cleveland. I think a lot of folks are going to decide to come home. Well, we all know it's no secret that Clevelanders carry a little bit of a chip on our shoulders oh, yeah. because if anybody else slams our city, we get very defensive mm. and then we back it up, right? Sometimes we grumble about it a little bit. I can't tell you the number of people who I know who have moved here, including other employees here in Northeast Ohio, who had never set foot in Cleveland. Yep. And they're like, this is a great place to live. It is a great place to live. And we're just now kind of getting into the swing of things with the weather improving. And, you know, we've had that glimmer of hope. Uh, we can roll that weather open because.